So guys, I just want to dig into Google Search Console again and something that I think is quite important from a technical point of view um, and that is your index coverage. So if you log into your Search Console, under index you'll see coverage and we'll be able to see how many URLs I've submitted and what is in Google's index and what those URLs are. So you can see here I've got 403 pages that have been submitted and indexed that are seen as valid by Google and that's a good thing. Of course when you submit your site to Google not every single one of your pages might get indexed. There may be reasons for that and you want to make sure that any page that you have which is a page that's designed to get traffic, rankings and everything else you need to make sure it's in the index. Now Google crawling your website doesn't necessarily mean it's going to be in the index reasons why you might not be indexed is duplicate content or there may be something on your website that's instructing google not to index that particular page or maybe they just can't get to that page because your internal linking is poor you haven't got it on a sitemap you don't have it in your navigation it's too many clicks deep whatever there must there, there will be a reason why some of your pages are not indexed now i've got a whole bunch of blog posts on my website and uh, and a whole lot of them are indexed and that's all I want. Now you can basically scroll down here and you can see all 403 URLs that are indexed and they are all of my money pages that I want to rank well. Now if you have pages in your website and they're not getting into that index, you're going to have to understand why and deal with that problem. Now, <coughs> as I say, not having them on a sitemap, maybe it's duplicate content. There is going to be a reason as to why it's not indexed, but this is how Google looks at your website. This is showing you what is indexed, and that is essentially a great guide, which is free to use, to fully understand what pages has in Google's index. Now, <coughs> when you look at your website, or when you submit your sitemap, stuff might not get indexed right away. After a few weeks, things should start to populate on here. But when you're building links to your pages, when you're releasing content more frequently, all of that is going to help Google get to your website and get it indexed. But one thing I want to make clear is it doesn't always get indexed as soon as it's crawled. Crawling and indexing are two different things, but make sure you do log into your search console to make sure that the work you are doing is actually having an impact and it is getting indexed on Google's indexing system because if it's not, it's never going to rank. So that is the first priority to make sure that you are getting your pages indexed.